We know the ancestry of the family the Duchess of Cambridge married into, but today a rare glimpse of the history of the family she was born into. Letters relating to her great-grandmother's three brothers, all of whom fought and died in the First World War. One killed by a bomb, one by a sniper, and the third killed in action. She was familiar with the content of some of the letters, but I think that the special thing was being able to actually see the things themselves. Um, I mean, the opportunity to not only see and handle original letters from the First World War, but also um, letters relating to direct relatives, you know, who served in the war and sadly lost their lives. I've forgotten in how short amount of time he, he was on there. Yeah, six weeks. The Duchess was visibly moved by how brief this telegram is, announcing the death of one of the brothers in very few words, and bearing the Middleton name at the bottom. She was born in 1889. You don't have to be royal, though, to find out about your relatives at the Imperial War Museum. Their documents archive has stories of 7.6 million people, and they don't all end with the death of a soldier. One of the most poignant stories is, the, is that of Charlotte Mead, who was from London. She worked in a munitions factory. Um, very sadly, she died of TNT poisoning um, because of the chemicals that they were using, and she left behind four very young children. Her husband wasn't actually there when she died. He was serving out in France. And so it's a real role reversal. So you have the man who was coming home, uh, and his wife sadly had died. As part of the Duchess's visit, she stopped to look at the poppies outside. 886,246 were made to represent every British or colonial life lost at the front, three of whom were from her family.